hey guys welcome back to my channel i'm so sorry for the long break but we're back and we'll be doing better this time around today we'll be making a fang soup and i'll be using ingredients that everybody is conversant with and that you can easily support in your local market so starting here we have the water leaves this has been washed and chopped i have my afang leaves in here i'm going to be blending those as you'll see later on in the video i'm going to make use of some beef and stock fish you can use any protein of your choice i have my roughly blended pepper in here some smoked fish and cow skin popularly known as pomo some oil seasoning cubes and salt and crayfish i'll start off by um boiling my meat just my meat so i'm going to let this um cook i'll have just season with um seasoning cube and the water i used in rinsing off my blender i love my food spicy i want to like use all the spiciness i can get so i'm going to add a little bit of salt and just cover this up to cook for a bit not until i stir it so that you know my seasoning evens out and it all gets um blended with the water so a little backstory here i wanted to make a come with me to the market vlog while i was shopping for my soup ingredients but unfortunately my video was cut short by a truck pusher who nearly knocked me down so i had to like <laughs> face my front and do all my shopping so but i promise we'll be doing more of that next time so i'm going to add my stock fish and cow skin at this point my meat is halfway cooked so i want um the stock fish and the cow skin to cook up at the same time with the meat so they all get softened up together i'll cover this up and let it cook for a while so my meat is properly cooked at this point i won't be using any more water for this soup because of course our water leaves will give us all the juice we need for the soup so i'm going to add in my water leaf at this point you can use as much or as little as you want but as for me i want more water leaves in my afang compared to the quantity of the afang just more water leaves and a little bit of afang you know to balance it all out i don't like um afang has a little bit of bitter taste kind of and i just want to retain that water leafy taste so i'll be adding in my um, blended pepper at this point this pepper is quite spicy so i don't want to add up all of it so i'll be able to you know regulate um the amount of spice i want in my soup but i'll be adding more of it if i feel it's not enough so i'll just stir this out and i think i'll be adding in my crayfish at this point but not all of it just a little bit of the crayfish i know you're wondering why i'm not adding any water but don't worry you'll see that so i'm going to add my smoked fish too at this point because of course i want my smoked fish to get steamed a little yes it's a little bit smoked but it's been in the market you know flies and all of that so i just want it steamed a little for you know health purposes to keep it healthy i'll just cover this up and let it cook for a while while it releases its own juice now i'm back to my water leaves and it has been cooking finely and this is what it looks like see all the liquid we have in there so i'm going to be pouring in my blended um afang leaves this is what it looks like so i'll just pour this in please use very little amount of water when you're blending this in so your soup doesn't get really or super watery if your soup gets watery i don't know it just isn't nice so i'll be adding in the rest of my crayfish at this point and my palm oil now i don't know the science behind adding palm oil lastly in afang soup please if anybody understands this age-long tradition please let me know because i grew up and i found people doing it and i joined the bandwagon but i think i'll try making afang differently some other time um for the records i added the rest of my pepper off camera because it wasn't as spicy as i wanted it and guys that is it you just let this boil for a little before your soup gets ready but we don't want to have our afan leaves overcooked so we'll be blending we'll be boiling this for this long i think i'm going to add more palm oil i don't think i like the face so i'll be adding more palm oil to this and yeah that is it i'm sorry i like my food very colorful so i'll just stir this around some more and yeah i think that does it i like the face a little bit better now so i had to give my super face lift but you can use the amount of palm oil that you can tolerate but this is just how i want mine and guys that is it afang soup is ready tell me you enjoyed this recipe and tell me you're going to try it out because 
this is divine so we'll just cover it up and let it cook for a minute or two remember we don't want to overcook our afang and besides um uh, water leaves are already thoroughly cooked and that is it see why i said we shouldn't add more water because our water leaf is doing justice to that already and that is it i'll be serving this with semo today so guys thank you so much for watching you can serve this with any swallow of your choice if you enjoyed this video please give a thumbs up hit the subscribe button and turn on post notifications so you get notified whenever we post new videos like this and many more and if you have any corrections please i'll be willing to hear from you from the comment section thank you guys for watching and for sticking around do enjoy the rest of your day